On this week's boiler tip, we're back to warming up our deaerator. Now our deaerator needs steam in it to heat the water to go to the boiler. And on startup, and really when we're running, that steam comes from a pressure reducing station. The issue that we face on startup is that if our system pressure is below 20, 25 pounds, we don't have the pressure to operate our valve. So we won't get any steam into the deaerator until we've got 20 to 25 pounds on the system. And at that point, we're already making up water to the boiler and that water could be cold and we don't want that. So most pressure reducing stations have a piped bypass. So because this valve won't open until we have 20 to 25 pounds and we want steam in the deaerator as soon as possible, we can go ahead and open the bypass to the DA so that we can get system steam to the deaerator as soon as we have any. And that way any incoming water is gonna get heated and our deaerator's coming up to temperature way sooner. So as our system warms up, it's really important that once we get pressure on the deaerator, we start to throttle this down. And once we've got 30, 35 pounds on the system, we want to make sure it's closed completely because our deaerator is a pressure vessel, but it's got a relief valve on it. And if we leave this unattended and the pressure goes up enough, we're going to lift the relief valves on our deaerator. 